that is K-Force playing right here on Switchboard. My name is Shama Bisori and of course on the ones and twos is DJ Derek. Kevo, the last time I saw you was like, I think four years ago. It's been really, really long. How have you been? I've been good. You've been good? I've been good. Good. See, eh? see, this is my face. even though this is my changamka face. You know, guy, this is how kijamu na kongaji. What's the jam? Ah, nice one. Uh, so, Nataka, Kwanza, first of all, just tell me about um, there was award, uh, the Hip Hop Awards, the Uncut Hip Hop Awards that was happening last year. Yeah. Ulishinda Best Album. Yeah. And, uh, and the Alternative Media, yeah? Yeah, yeah. So how did you feel about that? Oh, it's a nice feeling to win, mm. always. Mm. For sure, for sure. It's yeah, always nice. So, yeah. yeah. It was a nice feeling. Uh, of course, nearly appreciate Manze, all mm -hmm. the guys who voted for your boy mm. and all that. So yeah, it was a nice feeling. Can't mm -hmm. complain. Like me and my team, mm. were happy that at least our efforts uh, have been mm. recognized. For sure. Yeah. So I know, I know, like from your stories, yeah, we talk sana when it comes to music and because uh, um, I know you started rapping. Uh, because, okay, most of the times now when I'm a hip hop artist, when I want to hear all the, the things they go through in their music, yes? Yeah. So, Najwa, what is it, is it one of the things that you inspire? Because, you know, coming from one of the slums, the biggest slums in Africa, is it one of the things that you inspire into rapping? Uh, yeah, and uh, that and a uh, love for the arts, too, yani, like mm. a, a, a general love for the arts. I think at a Maybe at a ningekwa, maybe in a different part of the world mm. or uh, under different circumstances. Yeah. I, I, I think I'd still be inclined to, you uh, know, just do the arts. So, um, gonna talk am tani, yes, mm. kwa challenging, yes, mm. kwa an influence, yes, mm. but uh, I think I've always like just been an artistic guy and since I was younger because I used to also act. Ni, ni, mm. ni, ni. I used to, you know, dabble in the arts, yeah. yeah. But is that where we put our because the way you write your lyrics? Yeah. Where? Mm. Okay, is it something you got maybe in high school, like my debates and all that? Uh, yeah, in a sense, but uh, I'd like to, like, when, when, when I'm making my music or coming up with my ideas mm. or writing my lyrics, I, I try to be... I try to be different from other guys, yeah. And mm. when you get, I, I try to to show a, a different perspective. Kulikoya mm. wase wengi ne, yani. Of course, we are all unique in our own ways, ni ni ni. ni but uh, I just try and, and 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 be as as realistic and as relatable as I can, mm. especially to the kind of demographic that I I, I appeal to. So yeah, uh, growing up in the hood, of course, he. But a lot of content mm. online, uh, plus it, it kind of just helped me to be grounded and, you know, just be humble and mm. appreciate, like, everything that comes my way, Ani. Mm. So the, the outlook, of course, is quite influenced by the kind of background that I had, but the music, especially the rap music, Ani, is mm. the obvious choice because it's not just hip-hop, like, besides entertainment, it's mm. like an escape for for most guys when you're not a car, like they have a, 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 a challenging background yani. mm. it, it doesn't have to be poverty it doesn't have to be like you come from a tough neighborhood mm. maybe we pia ulikuwa una, 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 una deal na self esteem yeah. issues when mm. you get True. so we confidence in you know trying to portray the art but in my mm. ch in, in my case it was definitely the poverty when you get it was definitely the the trying to stay away from you know yeah. the gangs yeah. and all that to come to ani so for me likwa ni the best way i could express myself it's true and it's the best way because that we have an artistic license kiasi mm. we, we can talk about what other people in society yeah. can talk about mm. we can use language that other guys can't use mm. so that means we can reach more guys than mm. A, a, a conventional guy too many and I try to like sure. trying to be politically correct, mm. you know. So yeah. Mm. So Kevo, is there anything you're doing right now to like help while you're trying, uh, the artists that are coming up? Yeah, mm. actually, you know, one of my platforms do you live in that uh, alternative media mm. category at the uncut uh, at the uncut Hennessy uh, Hip Hop Awards mm. 2020. So you need to have Fresh Bars Friday. Mm -hmm. uh, this is uh, 
a show that I run with my team. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm also one of the producers on the show as well. So we try and uh, connect uh, different guys from different backgrounds. When you want to hip hop, we try and bring them together. Yeah. Design we you, you will talk to you. You will tell us a bit more about yourself. Nini nini. Mm. Uh, you will tell us a bit more about your music and 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 like maybe the community or the society that you come from. Is of and then in the end we will do a project. Like we will mm. we will we'll force collaborate a, a, a project among the guys that we work with on mm. each episode. Nice. So in it a fresh bus Friday, you mm. guys can check it out. It's on YouTube, of course. Mm -hmm. Uh, I feel it's a way you could bridge the gap, man. Yeah. No, no, right now we are in a new school of hip hop. Yeah, mm. when you put a CC mm. up and in new school, yeah. but kuna wase ni yana from the old school. Yeah. Naskiza kina basu ko, naskiza mm. maybe kina bambo and keshaka and all that. So I felt like, like I was like like bro flani munya ko katikati ya kuivro munya neza like bring the old school and yeah. the new school so together, so that at least mm. kuku prachekwa na misconceptions kada up and apale yeah. you know so uh, fresh bus friday is a platform that showcases all the dope mm. kenyan hip hop yani hopefully this year maybe to get kwenda pakati z na ug but you know mm. it's all in the plans let's hope for the best yani yeah for sure for sure all the best with that yeah. but um are you an octo good now you were we rumors? were we ever like, did we ever have problems? Somehow? I had there were rumors, but it was alleged that you guys were beefing. Nah, I don't beef, man. Say. Okay. Yeah, I'm 30 years old, man. <laughs> you, you're past that. <laughs> I'm 30 years old. I can't. I can't be. I can't be. Okay, I don't know. Uh, maybe kuna another side of the story, mm. which which I also don't know. But personally, kifo kifo simse mone you support kilam say. Yeah. Because I know uh, you, I know you actually bl you played a big role yeah, in this career. Yeah, so me, me support Kilam say. Yeah. Uh, me will try to work with as many guys as I can, of course. Now mm. I'm Tani Kwetu Manze. They know me down there, man. I'm president. Mm. For sure. As far as this rap thing is concerned, yeah. So <laughs> True. I don't think uh, I have anything to gain. By you know. Plus, me and say like we just talked a few minutes ago yeah. about me trying to bring guys together. Yeah. So, what kind of example would I be setting yeah. if I'm if I'm stepping on other guys' toes, and out here still yeah. preaching like, "Yo, man, you know we need yeah. to be so, like to preach some solidarity and yeah. bring some unity into this little thing of ours." It acquire any double standards, man. She's guapa even na this was say tena na takaku beef na was say gomba na tena. On the other hand, because me, I'd, I'd like to lead by example, man. Mm. I, I don't want to lead by my words, Peke. Mm. You were in Cook Studio some time back. Uh, yeah. How was the experience? Uh, it was sour. It was sour. Mm. I can't complain. Will you say it opened doors? It was a larger platform mm. than, than, than most. Because yeah. uh, I, th I think they have a wider reach than local media mm. yeah so it was an eye-opener uh, it introduced me to uh, a, a wide variety of international artists but most of the guys that we did the cock studio with are my mm. homies so yeah. maybe the only person that i got to meet up with when it was outside of my circle mm. was maybe guys like uh maybe am mm. you see but all these other guys nazizi bamboo yeah, calligraph are yeah. only my dudes man so csz Sizi feel like uh, it was a new experience yeah. for me because we mm. we've been working together for a while. So mm. yeah, but as a platform, mm. it was huge because I was getting love from guys who wouldn't necessarily know me if mm. it wasn't for Cox Studio guys from South Africa, yeah. guys from Nigeria, nini nini. So yeah, mm. it was a it was a, a a gateway to of some of some sorts to mm. you know just rubbing shoulders with other guys who do what I do. Does this song of yours I really like? It's called Kill a King. Mm. Where? Madam Fanyevo, because we first of all, me and Liskia, I was like, what? What inspired that song? I was like, I like when bombs Really? I was like, 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 I don't know, maybe money. Huh? Yeah. So, <laughs> 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 don't do the song, but uh, uh, but in all honesty, uh, Giuliani put up the challenge, okay, uh, and a lot of guys were can mm. participate, so mm. I had to do some. 
uh, Sasa. So just tell us about now the new song that you have. Hmm. Yeah, Nikona Nikona new release yeah. out on YouTube and it a different freestyle. Mm -hmm. I think it's the first project I've put out this year. Mm -hmm. It's not necessarily a song per se, but uh it's 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 a it's a freestyle. Mm -hmm. You uh, freestyle zangus na a bit more serious than more study. Mm. Guys like to think of them as songs, but yeah, yeah but <laughs> it's, 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 it's a freestyle. It's on YouTube, guys can check it out. Yeah. It's a different freestyle by Kevo K4. So, yeah, man, it's just, you know, it's a break year 2020, man. We, we haven't gotten to the, mm. to the main course. So it's just a, a, a little introduction of what's to come mm. in the year. Why is our sour? Yeah. With a banger. Any new projects you're working on? Yeah, uh, I'm working on a new album, of course. Uh, actually, two new albums. Moja in it was number nine drill. Na ifanya na mboi zangu kumtani. Some some of them are new. Nah, not some. Actually, all of them are new guys. And you are saying you're not jaribu kwa porona as well. So na cheki at least to to grow the culture in my hood ni ni ni. And the other one is my personal album. Uh, dates on them are not precise. But only works in the under construction. They're still in the pipeline. Nini nini, but pole pole. I'll put the word out soon as soon as we're good to go. Yeah. So 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 that's your camera right there. Actually, let's go angle. Camera number five, the small one. This one. Yeah. So let's go angle. I see. Waku wambi like when is a pata happy. Every all the like the the show you're talking about and all that. Your handles. Oh okay. Talk to your people. Oh yeah, so you guys can check me out on Instagram and on Twitter at Kevo Kefos. That's K A Y V O K F O R C E, and you can also find my music on 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 YouTube. That's Kevo Kefos TV, and the other channel is Number Nine Skyline. It's also on 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 YouTube. Uh, but most importantly, Manze, if uh, you like Kenyan hip hop, and if you support the whole movement and all that, manze, you can also check us out on our platform. You go on YouTube and into Fresh Bars Friday, and you can also check out the Fresh Bars Friday radio show. Just check for the links on my social media. In Akwangapia, every Friday, nine to ten p.m. So, yeah, man, those are the platforms. Nini nini, but uh, you guys can also download my albums on Boomplay Music. Just search Kevo K Force. No, does it but as man? They all in there, man. You can also check me out on iTunes and all that. For when you on Ngianga, these are platforms in Guinea's of Maju. But yeah, man, appreciate the love, appreciate the support. So love. Ah, yes, so for sure. But thank you so much for coming through, K Force. To Mishkuru Sana. Thank you very much for having me. Ah, yeah. All right, so that was K Force right here on Switchboard. And I uh, remember, guys, I was asking you actually on the vibe of the day is Nairobi that bad or is it just an exaggeration? Now, no, no, guys are talking a lot about, about all this on our SMS line. I'm just going to read a couple. Uh, your number ends with 1827. And I say, show ime bamba fiti, mimi ni purity. Kutoka Mombasa, thank you so much for tuning in. Uh, in M, it's April from Kino at K, Kevo K Force is on Flick. Uh, and you are Miss Kia, thank you so much for tuning in. Your number ends with 3 3. And as my switchboard sham, I'm telling you, you're looking hot. My gosh, thank you so much. Your number ends with 9554. And as my hi, Nileni Kutoka Nanyuki. Um, no, Liza Care Force, I'm a Come on. <laughs> It's, he's the one who's rapping all that. Ah, your number ends with 220. And I by Zucho. I think we've actually played that two times now, I think. <laughs> uh, your number ends with 63. And I say, hey, Yvonne from Nakuru. Show Iko Fire. Thank you so much for tuning in. Uh, your number ends with 86. And I say, uh, Jua Iko Huku ni Turkana. Nairobi na watua wa keini wa baya. <laughs> show is, is a killer. So I'm guessing anasema see you in Nairobi no bani watu nyokondani no baya. Alright, so, so right now though I think we're going on a musical break. We'll be right back. <laughs>